Chino is great because we care. Chino is great because of the businesses that reside here. Chino is great because of all the wonderful people that live and work here. Chino is great because we are a strong community. Chino is great because of the proximity to the port. Chino is great because we're family oriented and we love our community. Chino is great because it's where everything grows. The state of the city of Chino is fantastic. We have balanced growth, we have fiscal stability, beautiful community with diversity. I care very much about Chino because our family is vested in this community. Chino is a great place to live because of the people. We still have a small town feel in Southern California and it's something to be proud of. Even though the city has grown, you're only one or two degrees of separation from a neighbor or from a good family friend, and that's one of the things that's best about Chino. We were once a farming community, and a farming community is always very close-knit. Neighbors helping neighbors, families staying together. We have that in the community of Chino. About 11 years ago, my husband and I had just gotten married, and we wanted to find a place to raise our family. And we drove out here, and we were in love. So we found a house and we have been here ever since. In fact, we just sold our house uh, to move into a slightly larger house also in the preserve. We have a great school system here. Uh, so if, you, if you're a young person and you're moving here and you want to raise a family, this is where you want to be. Educational opportunities in Chino are wide. Obviously, you can go from elementary school to high school, but we also have Chafee College within our community, so you can get your associate's degree. They have a very strong program at Chafee that is connected with a concurrent enrollment. Individuals from high schools can enroll, so when they graduate from high school, they have their high school diploma, plus they can have their certification for a trade. In the state of California, housing is at a premium, so Chino's always done a good job of having something for everyone. I would like to have something for everyone in our community. And that literally means from housing, to recreation, to jobs, to shopping opportunities. You can work here, you can live here, you can play here. You can do everything in the city of Chino. We have large parks that allow for big softball tournaments and all kinds of soccer games going on. Ayala Park is a primary example of a, a park that we have that is utilized all the time. The facilities are absolutely beautiful. I love it because I, uh, I played football here actually. It's pretty fun being back here with our kids now. I love that my kids see their friends at school and then they go to the so they play soccer, they see their friends there, they see them at the baseball field. My son Andrew here. <laughs> it's a great park. It's one of the best parks around, and my five-year-old enjoys it. Yeah, this is one of the best skate parks around. You know, being able to have your kids come and skate, you know, every, every city should have something like this. But if you look around, this, the community is awesome. They have parks, they have skate parks, the, the baseball fields, the football fields, the activities, the events that they have. Fourth of July, it's, it's awesome. Community events are critical to our community because it keeps people together. Some of the big ones, of course, are a Christmas youth parade. We have our big fireworks spectacular. And those things are attended. With thousands of people are here and I think what it is is that we just do large-scale events to bring the community together. The City of Chino partners with IUA to sponsor the Earth Day celebration. We have environmental activities that we um, actually co-host here. We come together to form this great partnership to bring the community together and learn how to save the earth. Being a part of an event like this where the community can be involved as well as the, the different businesses and environmental agencies makes Chino great. We have so many street fairs, there's you know the car shows, the Christmas parades. We also have big corn feed car show that's enormous with uh, gosh almost a thousand cars being shown in that. Chino is very fortunate to have so many service clubs in the community. You have Chino Kiwanis that puts on this event. The weather is beautiful, the cars are beautiful. Everyone comes from everywhere in Southern California to come to Chino. They can't wait for this event every year. You know you go there and who's there? Every one of the city council members there. Uh, Walt on the planning commission's like running it. Uh, you've got the city manager there with his family, running a corn booth, uh, all kinds of city staff, business leaders, community leaders. People get involved in this city. It's, it's, it's really remarkable. Chino is an extremely safe community. The elements that make Chino safe, of course, are our police department and our fire department. We have excellent, two excellent organizations. Public safety is particularly important. People have to feel safe in their communities. It's a state-of-the-art facility that now houses the entire police department, and our new headquarters is really helping propel us into the future in that manner. The Chino Valley Fire District is an all-risk fire department, which means that we're trained and ready to respond to any type of emergency situation 
transition that the Chino Valley might face. We're all working together with this common goal of providing the best service to the community. Balanced growth is more than just housing. It also entails the job market. And in Chino, we have a very diverse industrial and commercial area that provide all kinds of work opportunities for our own citizenry. This diversity and this balance between residential and commercial industrial is key in keeping our city financially stable. Well, Chino has done a lot to attract businesses here to the community. We've been able to build warehouses, we've been able to build new businesses here uh, because of our location uh, precisely has really helped in attracting businesses. The city of Chino is so blessed to have so many great businesses in, the, in our community, but one in particular that stands out to me is Mission Linen. I am so proud to have them in, in Chino. They service our linens here at the Chino Police Department. They do a great job, and I hope they stay here for a long time. We located in October, it'll be 25 years that we've been in Chino. This, this by far is probably the ideal place for us to have built this facility because of the logistics for it, so it made the best sense to come here. So NFI, which stands for National Freight Industries, is a distribution and transportation company. We have about six million square feet here in Chino, California. We're definitely going to continue the relationship. We have a great relationship with Chino. Chino has been very friendly to manufacturers. What's surprising is when they walk in the back and exclaim, you really make it here, you know, because most people assume the U.S. doesn't make products, but, you know, here we do make it. One day it's a lift of lumber sitting in the back, and next day it's a load of chairs going out. We say, made in Chino. Small businesses are critical for the quality of life in a community, and we're very blessed in the city of Chino to have many mom and pop type businesses here. Royalty Cakes is a custom cake shop and we do custom works of art. We were looking for a location and uh, Chino seemed to fit the bill. As time's gone on, it's been amazing. They have just made it so spectacular and, and welcoming and inviting and I just, I couldn't be happier. Chino is very unique in that we're located in Southern California in an area where we're literally close to about everything. We're bordered by several major freeways, the 60 freeway, the 10 freeway, the 71, the 15, the 91. We're right next to an international airport, which is perfect. You don't have to drive into Los Angeles. We're geographically located in a very, very good area. Why did we come to Chino? Um, we initially came to Chino because this is probably one of the best locations anywhere in the country for the logistics industry. We build industrial buildings, warehouses, and distribution facilities. It's one of the closest markets to the two largest ports in the country. But once, once you're here in Chino, and it doesn't take very long, you figure out that Chino is a great place to have your business. Chino is a very forward-thinking city. They've developed very clear specific plans, very clear general plans. What we need to be doing is thinking about the next 30, 40, 50 years. So we're redoing this strategic plan. We're also looking at a master plan for downtown town and also an overlying master plan for our sphere of influence which will someday annex into the city of Chino. There are two additional warehouses going to be built, a 1.1 million square foot warehouse literally down the street from us right now and an additional 900,000 square foot warehouse. Basic infrastructure of course are your roads, your water system, your sewer system and Chino has spent a lot of money in the last several decades ensuring that our infrastructure is strong and stable. Well, we have a number of improvements in Chino coming up, especially the, the largest one is the 60 Freeway Central Overpass, which will be widening by the end of this year. It does take money to run the city, and thankfully we are very financially stable. The business community contributes a tremendous amount of value to our community. Watson Land Company happens to be the second largest property taxpayer in the city of Chino. When we're completed with our development here, we'll have about 7 million square feet of industrial space, 18 industrial buildings. We think we'll, we'll be employing somewhere between 2,000 to 2,500 employees. We bring a lot of jobs to the community, which we think is a big benefit. Right here in Chino, we have about 350 employees. What we put back into the local economy in this general area is over $18 million with a payroll. We have about 1,700 employees. 75% of them come right here from Chino. They're here to work. They earn an honest wage and we definitely appreciate the folks in Chino. With the number of companies that have come here, if you can work in this town, if you can live, you can basically stay in this town and enjoy life. We obviously have to take care of everyday problems, but to be a quality city that's sustainable, you have to look into the future and plan for the future. It's a wonderful community, and I want it to continue to be fantastic way, way into the future.
we're going to develop smarter cities. And through smarter cities, we will build safer cities in the future. I can't think of a community that can offer so much to so many young people. Where else would you want to go? I mean, everything you need is right here in Chino. Uh, to me, it's just easy living here. Definitely a, a city I would say I'm proud of. There's no other city that I would ever want to work or live in. We're going to stay. This is where we're going to be. Chino. Something for everyone. Something for everyone. Something for everyone. Something for everyone. Chino. Something for everyone.